move your bong. I don't want to move it. I don't want to break it. <laughs> COVID. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. I don't know what to do. You guys holding up all right? This moron thinks I'm going to move in with my daughter. Hey, that'd be great. She hasn't asked. She's not gonna. I'm not going anywhere. Is there an option to run? Today's gonna be a good day. Uh, what did you do? You know, it's great to play games when I have no sense of direction. I'm looking, it's this way. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. <laughs> she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. m and we'll see famous. what you have. You're not. Interesting. Oh, nice. Where did she find it? Why did you put your I'm really not sure. Movie? Boy, what is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. Sorry. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. <laughs> Scared the hell out of me. <laughs> Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Why take the risk? Hurry up! Don't. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. You know, the business community's really... Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Quit touching my shit. <laughs> I'm gonna hurt you. <laughs> Very badly. I heard you got that level dodge. I heard you got that level dodge. What do you think you're doing?
Got some time to kill before Doc needs me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. Dangerous. Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry. I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Attention all units. We have a possible kidnap. Hello? Peter. It's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey. What's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I, I didn't forget, forget, I just... Uh, I'll be there soon. <sighs> this tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. <sighs> He's right. How did I lose track of time? in a narcotic fail. Mobilize that touchdown. Flying pretty close to blind. Ought to look for towers to activate. We got this, Spider Man. Thanks anyway.
Washington unit. Got a report of a mugging. Location is south of Houston. Muggers, gotta jump in. Who wants a picture? That's it? I feel like the holdup guys are phoning it in lately. Thanks, Spider-Man. I have to once again defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, a.k.a. The Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package J. Jonah Jameson refuses. Hey, an old-fashioned B&E. Gotta love the classics. Fisk's in. Oh, no! Man, Fisk goes away and suddenly it's amateur hour. So, they're all going to jail. 
Where I bet you'll be as good at break. Breaking out as you were at break. Breaking in. No, I'm a jerk. Available units. Report of an assault in progress. Incidents are going in the West Village. Are you really him? Commercial robbery in progress. Please proceed to Chelsea ASAP. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and... Yes! <laughs> hey! Hey! What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't 
your first violation. Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work. In a secure environment. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This is opportunity knocking. <laughs> easy, easy, easy. They, they, they didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter. There's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. Do something to help Doc. Call Harry. Ask him to talk to his dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. Should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. There must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. <laughs> 